what's happening folks Jero here aka jfro90 and i am back with another reaction of one of my favorite brother and sister duos of all time the carpenters with one of my favorite songs of all time a song for you now there's many renditions of this song that i love i've done a reaction already to whitney houston's live version donny hathaway is maybe my favorite recorded version i've never seen a live version. i don't know if that exists yet uh if you see me react to it then that means that's me finding out that it does but um a close second to donnie's version is easily easily the carpenters because as we karen was a master at putting feeling to songs she didn't write i don't think any of the songs that she did that was usually uh richard her brother but, um, God, she sang these songs like she was telling you about her life, her experiences. And that's what this song is about. I mean, it basically starts out that way. Similar to uh, Superstar. And like I mentioned last time, that was one of my favorites. I'm going to do a do-over for Superstar because I did not expect that video to be a, um, like, you know, how it was uh, the band playing with the screen i was expecting live performance so but i'm glad that it exists either way i'm still gonna leave that up because i did not expect that whatsoever so you know in time that might become a patreon exclusive so those of you who saw that you you got in on it good 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 uh this again one of my favorite songs by the carpenters uh one of my favorite renditions of this song but i've never seen a video of them performing it live and i vetted this video beforehand i just jumped to one part to make sure it's live <laughs> make sure that she's actually singing the song and it's not a collage of pictures or anything so let's get to it before we do don't forget to hit that bell for notifications and subscribe <laughs> and let's get to it the carpenters a song for you I've been so many places in my life and time I've sung a lot of songs, I've made some bad rhyme I've acted out my love in stages With 10,000 people watching But we're alone now and I'm singing this song Am I the only one every time when Karen makes a transition, I'm a, I'm a fool for transitions with singers, period. But Karen's one of them ones. <laughs> when she transitions from up here and then brings it down, it like, ooh, ooh, it like makes the hair on my arms and the back of my neck underneath the wig stand up. <laughs> like, I, that's just one of my favorite things in the world. So every time, I'm, I'm gonna say it this time so I don't have to repeat it. Anytime that happens in a song I'm reacting to, and especially any song that Karen Carpenter is singing that I'm reacting to, just know, just know, the wig is standing up a little bit more in the back because them hairs in the back and the neck is standing up, so. <sighs> Take it away. I know your image of me is what I hope to be. I've treated you unkindly, but darling, can't you see? There's no one more important to me. Darling, can't you please see through me? We're alone now, and I'm singing the song. Came out in front and I was hiding But now I'm so much better And if my words don't come together Listen to the melody Cause my love is in their hiding I love you one of my favorite lyrics ever Song 
for you We were alone and I was singing a song for you Ah, beautifully done, beautifully done Oh my god Man, and she looked fantastic, and Richard and the guys were doing a fantastic job playing back there. Oh, I love that song. Love that. It's funny, that's one of those songs where it's like, it just touches my heart. And it's just, like I mentioned, one of my favorite lyrics from a song ever. One of my favorite lyrics of a song ever is listen to the melody because my love is in there hiding. And I love that. I love that so much. As a music lover and as a fan of songwriters and all that. And see, that's the funny thing. Like I said in the beginning, she didn't write that song. But God, I, I, that would be shocking news to me if this was my first time hearing it. If I did not hear Donnie, if I did not, you know. And you know, that's the main, because I feel the same way about Whitney too, where... She didn't, she had that ability to sing a song to you like she is test telling you her story, like she is testifying to you. So, anyway, <laughs> I'm just rambling now. Um, more songs in the description, I mean, more songs in the comments. See, that's how Karen got me. More songs in the comments that you would like to see me react to from the Carpenters. Um, I'm probably gonna do some of Karen's from her solo album. Even I didn't, I am I didn't, I didn't care for it that much. It just wasn't her. It's like her best stuff really was with uh, her brother. But um, put more recommendations in the comments, and please thumbs up, subscribe. Um, if you want to follow me on my social medias, that's in the description below. And my birthday is January 27th, this coming Thursday. That's the day after tomorrow, y'all. I'm going be, I'm to be a whole year older. My goodness. Oh, Lord. Even though, I, as y'all can tell from these reactions, I got a pretty old-ass soul anyway. <laughs> my my taste in music and movies and clothes and hair. This is 1987 hair here. But my taste in all those things is much older than 32. So, you know. Um, but I said that to say, if you feel like making a donation for my birthday then i much appreciate it it goes towards all of this yeah like i said uh you know i really love doing this and i really love connecting with you guys in the comments and talking about music talking about your experiences reading your experiences if i haven't gotten to your comment yet or haven't gotten to respond to your comment yet reading your experiences mean a lot to me i i i like taking that in i like so you know share with me more of your stories on the carpenters more of your experiences with the carpenters and i definitely will read them and take them seriously so thank you guys again for watching and this isn't a song for you but it's a video for you <laughs> and the carpenters um and take care of yourselves and each other Saying that I want it.